One year later to the day, halfway across the world, a 6.9 quake rips open the earth beneath the Colby's million and a half unsuspecting residents. The quake mangles the city into submission, cutting off vital services to nearly one million households. The nation best prepared to handle earthquakes learns that no one is safe from the wrath of these massive beasts. The old city of Kobe was built with very narrow streets and the uh, fires that broke up after the earthquake um, just couldn't be extinguished because fire engines couldn't get along those narrow streets. Thousands of people can do nothing but watch as their lives go up in flames. Kobe was uh, a lesson for the world and for the Japanese um, because the Japanese felt that they had um, better earthquake resistance than in fact they had. Even the great Hanshin superhighway, the pride of Kobe, falls on its side reminding us that even our grandest designs are no match for the power of the shifting Earth. Earthquakes can occur almost anywhere in the world, but the places that are most prepared are the places that have them all the time. It's gentle reminders that these things can happen.